Hey, it's Shot TV's Kevin Hirschfield here. We're standing in Central Park today and we're doing some paint flinging, believe it or not. I've got Jan Nato here from Artbeat Studio. Jan, thanks for joining us. Tell us what the paint flinging is all about today. So the activity was called the distance from A to B and uh, we hope that this activity, as well as being fun, because you, you saw that so many people were laughing and having such a great time, we hope that it'll promote crossing that distance between A and B. Understanding each other, despite our differences, despite any barriers between us, language, culture. We want people to cross that distance. Do you do events like this? Uh, are, are they popular events like this? Oh, Have you yeah. done it but like this before? Well, you know, this is the first time we've done this specific event, but Studio, uh, Studio Central is an urban art center, which is a project of Artbeat Studio. We're committed to going out into the communities, making art, having that be a, a way to promote understanding and cooperation, and also to promote wellness. You saw how happy people were. We started as a mental health uh, recovery program at Artbeat Studio. We've expanded to be bringing art right into the communities and we promote wellness, understanding, healing, empowerment through creativity. Okay, and elaborate just a little more on what you need, mean between connecting A and B together, like you said. Well, to be for yes. the artist who led it, is the one who gave the project the name and he meant it at first that this very literal, the distance from A to B, the distance between the jug and the canvas that you're throwing it. So that was the original conception of the title and then that grew in our conversation about what we do as an as a organization and what he believes in as a person. He's visiting here from Ethiopia, he has family that lives here and it's that, that distance between us that we don't always cross but it, it started from the literal and it grew a deeper meeting. We saw some newcomer families here as well. How do you hope today's event uh, maybe benefits them down the road? Well, we're neighbors to them. So Mosaic uh, Newcomer Family Resource Network is right across the park from us. And, and we wanted to make sure that we reached out to our neighbors, just as, as we hope people in the suburbs, people downtown, in their homes can reach out to their neighbors. So we hope that they continue to come to us if they would like to make some art, if they would like to share their art. They have such different understandings of art and different forms of it. So we hope that this is a first step in having them share more with us and we share more with them and that two-way street that we believe should exist in all parts of life. Uh, and I gotta ask, where is this gonna be hung up? Are people gonna have an opportunity to see this you know, out in public? That's remained to be seen. Like, it, So the piece isn't quite complete yet. We're gonna let it dry, we're gonna then Cut it up, embellish it further, and then re sew it up. So it'll be with Artbeat Studio. It'll likely be on display at Studio Central at Triple Four Kennedy or at our uh, retail boutique outlet at uh, Portage Place on the second floor by YMCA. But we'll keep you posted. Okay, sounds good, Jan. I know from Artbeat, thank you very much for joining us here today at Central Park doing some paint flinging. Yeah.